Hey you guys! If you want to see how I achieved this cute and bouncy flexi rod set, then go ahead and keep on watching. I'll be using this Berry Bliss Butter that I was sent from Berry Curly Naturals. And as you can see, it is a nice creamy consistency. It smells just like strawberries and cream, and also it kind of just melts in your hand. This being my first flexi rod set, I wanted to do it on wet hair, so I'm taking a small section of hair, wetting it with my spray bottle of water, and then I'm going to detangle with my wide tooth comb. Next, I'm going to be taking my Berry Bliss Butter and applying that to my hair and this instantly gave me moisture and shine and also I like how it gave me a nice elongated curl. Also from Berry Curly Naturals, I'll be using this Wild Berry Growth Oil and this is just going to help seal in my moisture and then also it will help to promote hair growth. And you don't need a lot of this, a little bit goes a long way. Now it's time to begin putting in the flexi rod and to not have those puffy roots, I just twist um, my root and then I begin um, twisting my hair around the rod making sure to leave like a little bit of space in between just so that I have a nice elongated curl Now it did start to feel a little bumpy right here so I went back and kind of just detangled it with my finger. You want to make sure your hair is completely smooth when you're doing this and once you get to your ends you want to just wrap that around the rod as best as you can and then to secure it you're going to just bend the flexi rod up and over your ends. And then um, you'll also just bend um, the flexi rod down over your roots. Now again, you're going to just kind of twist your roots so that they're not puffy and then go ahead and wrap your hair around the flexi rod, making sure to leave some space so you can have a nice elongated curl. Once you get to the ends, just go ahead and roll them around your the flexi rod and then to secure them, you're just going to bend the flexi rod over your ends and then over your root. Here is a little close up of me putting my ends around the flexi rod your ends will stay um, as long as you have enough product as you can see it kind of just stays on the rod and then um, you know putting the flexi rod over your ends just helps to secure it even more So my hair is completely finished, it took me 3 hours to do this, but yeah, I'm just going to let it dry for a whole day just to be on the safe side. Now after a long, horrible night of no sleep, um, I'm just going to take down the flexi rods as you see. I just unbend the um, ends of them and then... Um, you know kind of unravel it the opposite way that I put it in and yeah So this is 
is what my hair looks like with all of those flexi rods out of my head. You don't understand how good it felt. But of course, I do have to separate to give these curls some life. To separate these flexi rod curls, I kind of unwind the curl um, just because it was twisted at the root. And then I just take small pieces, um, whether it naturally parts or not, and then I twirl the end. And that's it. It's really simple. I do like to add oil to my fingers before I separate my curls but I feel like my hair had enough oil I honestly could have just went ahead and only used that berry bliss butter because it was super moisturizing and already had enough oil in itself um, so that's just a tip if you do decide to get these products and um, try the style out This is the final result of my flexi rod set you guys and I'm so in love with it oh my gosh um, I was posting pictures on Instagram all day but yeah I didn't feel the need to fluff my hair I loved my hair the way it was um, so if you guys enjoyed this tutorial go ahead like comment share and subscribe and I will link everything down in the description box as well as a discount code for these very curly naturals products so thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!